I'm Horny Mike. Basically, I try to put horns in everything. Every Counting Cars fan knows and loves Mark Henry, who is also known as Horny Mike. His wild personality, innovative creations, and his love for horns made him a quick fan favorite. But did you know about his life before Counting Cars? What are the reasons behind his differences with the show's owner Danny? And more importantly, what's he doing these days? Watch this video till the end to know some shocking updates about Horny Mike that you didn't know. Today, he might be known as an airbrush artist, but it wasn't the same as his initial days. It's challenging to determine the precise moment he became a part of the shop, but he someday left his position as a t-shirt painter to join the Count's custom. Most of Mike's creations and best works happen there. At the same time, Counting Cars has become a highly popular reality TV show after being on the air for several years. Do you know the reason behind his nickname? Let me tell you, it's all because of his undeniable passion for adding everything with horns. Whether it's cars or helmets, he just can't resist adding that touch of uniqueness. This obsession drove him to become a famous figure in Count Custom's esteemed group, establishing himself as a recognizable member. Mike's strong love for horns is obvious through his dedicated website, which offers a wide range of attractive helmet accessories. Well, Mike knows that his obsession with horns and his unique approach may not always align with Danny's preferences, as Danny is the owner of Counting Cars, yet he customizes his every design to fulfill what the customer needs. We all have seen that he couldn't use his horn art in every project that he did on the show, but in spite of that, he became the most popular entertainer and fans' number one contestant, and no doubt, his magnetic charisma, his character, and expertise are the reasons behind it. Since his appearance on Counting Cars, Mike has experienced several remarkable car paint jobs. One of the most notable ones is the restoration and repainting of the Corvette. Additionally, he transformed the Horn Smart Car, a small electric vehicle, into a green monster, decorated with impressive illustrations and his signature horns on top. Furthermore, Mike painted a 1973 GMC truck with a medieval theme. Mike has turned his life around since he joined Count's Customs and Counting Cars. The show has given him immense fame and success, and no one denies that not many people are up to date with Mike's life. So, before getting into what he's doing nowadays, it's important to know that Horny Mike is still an active member of the popular television series Counting Cars, despite some assumptions made by viewers. The reason for the confusion is that Mike had limited appearances during the show's ninth season. Although this might have been seen as a negative sign, it is quite normal considering the shorter duration of the particular season of Counting Cars. This is likely due to the COVID-19 protocols that Count's customs had to follow in 2020. By briefly looking at his Twitter and Instagram accounts, it's clear that Mike is doing pretty well for himself. It seems like Mike is having a swell time at Count Customs and he still works at the shop. You can catch his work on his Instagram account, where his social media presence has attracted a significant number of fans from the show, ensuring his continued success in the industry. Mike is the owner of his own company, which specializes in many personalized horn helmets. Additionally, he has recently shifted to a new home in 2021. Mike enjoys a comfortable and stable occupation. We are interested in hearing your opinions on him and which of his innovative creations you love the most. Share your thoughts in the comment section below. That's all for today's video. See you in the next